Hello and welcome to the channel. My name is Sam and you are watching NN Sam in Thailand. So as you can see right now, I am at a coastal city over here in Thailand. So this city is the city of Siracha. And in today's video, I'm going to talk about why do I think that this city could be the best city for retirees to live over here for a longer duration of time. Now, first thing first is the location of the city. This city is only around 20 something kilometers from the city of Pattaya. So I prefer this city compared to Pattaya because this city is like more relaxed. There is less traffic, less crowd, less tourists. So when you live over here for a longer duration of time, you do feel like you you don't have to see like new faces every day and when you go out you don't like get mistaken as a tourist as well which is a good thing when you live in a country you don't want to feel like a tourist all of the times so you don't want to be treated as a tourist so the first reason why i like the city for living a longer duration of time is going to be its location it's uh, not way too far from Pattaya it's only around 20 kilometers and it's not far from Bangkok either so you get to go to both cities easily from over here now let's talk about the second point and the second point is going to be the size of the city so this city is not way too big like Pattaya or Bangkok Bangkok is capital so it's definitely the biggest city but this city is not way too big and it's not way too small either you can get good condos and apartments over here for an affordable price which is a good thing you can get a small cities like Cho like Chachan Sao as well uh, but the beauty of this place is that it's way too close to Pattaya for somebody who just want to go Pattaya or let's say Bang Sen which are like beach cities over here in Thailand famous beach cities so this place um, does have that you can easily go to beaches from over here now before I talk about more points let me go to that island over here so that's a small island over here and they have a temple on that island so let's go and check out that temple and then we will talk about more points. Let's check out the temple from over here, the biggest attraction in Sri Racha. All right, so I'm over here. It's just beautiful. And if you look over here, ferries to Kosi Chang probably goes from over here. So Kosi Chang is a famous island that's nearby from over here. It's like around 15 kilometers. little bit of a steep climb over here but the view of the city from over here are just mesmerizing Okay, now let's get down and continue with this video and let's talk about more points to why you should like consider Siracha as an option to retire. And now talking about the another good point of living in Siracha. So the thing is that it's a coastal town so definitely there is going to be humidity over here but the temperature over here is less compared to Isan so in Isan we are getting around 42 degrees Celsius right now but over here it's around 35 36 so temperature is uh, definitely less but due to humidity it's going to like be sweaty so if you drink a lot of water because of humidity you are going to sweat more that's the thing about uh, about cities over here, be it Padaya or Siracha. So another good point of living in a small town is that you don't have to wait a lot in the traffic. Like Padaya is good and all, but if you just get out of your condo, you just have to wait in the traffic for a long time if you live in Padaya. And in Bangkok is the same as well. Uh, but like 
an another thing about Pattaya is that most of the streets are just one way so you just have to like uh, take a long way if you have to go somewhere so that makes it kind of hard for people to live in a city like this because for their everyday day-to-day -day life they just have to wait uh, for a long time on in the traffic which is not convenient but over here it's easy the streets are not one way most of the streets are two way and there is like literally way too less traffic so it's easier to live in a city like this the another point is going to be the availability so another point is going to be convenience uh, it's convenient to live over here because they have grab bolt and everything so you can get food delivery services as well as uh, ride sharing apps uh, to like if you want to go somewhere you just can order grab so that somebody grab driver going on with some food delivery and we have these song theos cheap 10 baht taxis over here as well if you live over here you will know the directions they go to if you look behind me there is a taxi stand so these are like a small taxi stands spread all over many cities in thailand so you can just come over here and they will go to your location it's easier to book taxi like this as well but yes these days most of the people just prefer grab or bolt which are cheaper as well like bolt is way too cheap now when it comes to food you can get many countries restaurants over here especially japanese indian and europeans so it's, it's easy to get different cuisine as well So I'm told that most of the vehicles like uh, Song Theos that go to Pattaya go from over here. So this is like an important place for this city. I can see some Song Theos and vans over there and on this side also I can see some vans. So maybe this is the main place for people who want to go to Pattaya. So I asked them over here, these vans go to Pattaya for 50 baht. Taxi. It's going to cost me 21 baht to go to like 2 kilometers. Right, so we got some monkeys over here as well. So this is a monastery but views from over here are beautiful. So now it's time for people. So you can see most of Siracha from this point over here. That's why I came to over here to check the view of the city. So it's not like densely populated or something. Most of the buildings are not skyscrapers but we do have some tall buildings uh, as you can see over there and over in this side so if you are coming over here just book a grab or bolt bike or a car and it's easier to come that way all right so now talking about the another good thing about siracha is that you have all kind of medical facilities that most people need over here available as well like uh, there are big hospitals over here just like uh, other big cities or small cities in thailand so it makes it easier for somebody who is living over here for a longer time to get uh, good health care if you need some special doctors like uh, uh, some specialists you can easily find them in Pattaya or in Bangkok which are not far from over here now if I talk about the condos you can easily get good condos from over here depending on your budget so you can get expensive condos in towers like these or you can get cheap condos in like lo local neighborhoods in the hoods so yeah it just depends on what is your budget so it's evening time and I'm at the Robinsons over here so I'm gonna check it out and see how it is, how it actually is. Okay, so we have food market over there, a little bit of it. So yeah, this is like the happening place of Siracha. 
and this is how the traffic is around six half in the evening see these noodles It's a city, but the prices are like we have in villages as well. There are some clothes over here, as usual, second-hand clothes, the old clothes, which is uh, common over here in Thailand. People do buy clothes like these, and some like uh, like electric devices. If I show you the price of the clothes, let's check it out. It's only 10 baht. Can you see it? So. But in that people can choose this dress. It's just crazy. We are inside now. Anyway, this is just a mall, so I don't think anyone would be interested in seeing a mall because there are so many of them already. But yeah, this is like the biggest mall over here. All right, and this over here is a little bit of nightlife area of Siracha. So they have clubs, bars, and everything in this area. It's near Robinson. So if you come over here, you will find it. If you are interested in nightlife. So Siracha is a good place for anybody who is looking to live for a long time. Anyway, I will end this video over here. There are so many birds surfing around. So I will end this video over here and I will see you in the next video. Have a great day ahead. I will see you in the next video. Till then, peace.